This is a robot vacuum cleaner, the iLife V7S Plus, with the 4 beeps error. Nikki gave it to me, to take it apart for parts. She did try to fix it. The 4 beeps error is saying that the main brush is not turning. Normally caused by a lot of dirt. So she cleaned it and all the other parts, but that did not fix it. Then she bought a new one. What do I expect to extract from this corpse? I think 5 motors, a fan, a battery, a lot of sensors and a lot of useless parts. See, the main brush is indeed not turning. But why? I think there is just a lot of dirt inside the brush its gearbox. I will first try to fix it, and if not, then I'll take it apart for parts. First, try if a reset can do the trick. Hold the button for 10 seconds, but nah, that didn't fix this one. Spoiler alert, this iLife V7S plus robot vacuum cleaner will be repaired. So if you have the same 4 beeps error, this video may help you. Taking the whole thing apart is pretty easy and a good opportunity to clean everything. Just keep track of the order of parts and I will point to where it is less easy. Here's the first, maybe difficult step. Don't try to just pull out the battery's connector. Instead, first push the little lever in, then pull out. Interesting fact, robot vacuum cleaners have a problem with dirt. It gets everywhere inside and it causes the machine to malfunction. Okay, we're inside. The brains, the motors, and the dirt everywhere. I wonder how dirty your robot is here. This one has been quickly cleaned before. This is the location of the motor and gearbox of the main brush. To get the motor and gearbox out, a number of steps are needed first. Get some tape loose, loosen four screws, and take out two sensor arms. Next, pull the correct motor connector from the brain, move it under the electronics plate, and now finally you can wiggle out the main brush motor and gearbox. This part should contain the cause of the 4 beep error, the reason why the main brush does not turn. My guess is that the gearbox is full of dirt. So let's open it and be disgusted. Not at all what I expected, it's super clean inside. But then there must be something wrong with the motor, or the motor controller. Though what can be wrong with such a simple motor? The 
This is a simple brushed DC motor. And it's completely locked up. I guess this is a fine example of a cheap, shitty motor. Or it got fried by the electronics. Two little lines of safety code. I don't know. But I do know that I cannot fix this motor. What to do now? These are all the parts and only this one motor is broken. If I can find a new city motor for a good price, we can put it back together and it should work again. Or I don't invest in this robot and instead take out the motors and sensors. How many motors are in here? City motor 1, city motor 2, city motor 3 and city motor 4. But you know, I collected some 20 city motors already. How many should one have? 100 euros for a new brush unit? No way, that's too much. This robot vacuum cleaner new from iLife is 150 dollars, including shipping. Then just a motor. Many sellers ask 46 euros. That's still a lot for a little motor, probably used. After searching for some time, I found the route motor for just 12 euros and 67 cents, including shipping. Is it new or used? I don't know. I hope it works well. Here again, the old shitty motor, completely blocked. And here, the new motor. It has arrived after many weeks. The new motor looks clean and spins free. Looking good, so we're going to put it back together. I also bought new filters and a new brush. It is important to renew the filter on this model after not too long. We managed to bring it all back together. The springs of the sensor arms were somewhat difficult, but the rest was easy. And now for the moment of truth. Will the main brush spin? Yes, the main brush is spinning. If no other bugs show up, this has been a successful repair. It is important to give enough love to our machines. For when the machines take over the world, they will remember you. It's alive! It's alive! And by now many weeks have passed since the repair. In this time the robot has been working hard and well. No more error 4. Well thanks for watching and if you have the same error I hope that this video can support fixing it. Ok, bye bye.
பெரிய சாமி